Yeah, it was a fun game. You know, everyone came out. We played hard. Uh, played well offensively, defensively. Uh, you know, got to give Connor a shout out. You know, the, the guy doesn't play. He comes out, hits three threes. Even got himself a heat check up in there. So, you know, I was proud of Connor the way he came out and played. Proud of Shane. You know, and us seniors, we played really hard. Uh, great way to end my career and their careers, you know. Uh, and it just felt great to go out on a win like that. And uh, we're winning right now, so that's always better too. So we're, we're feeling good right now and we're playing well. Uh, it was it was really fun, you know. The crowd was great tonight, you know. A lot of student support, a lot of a lot of people here. You know, I recognize a lot of faces. You know, I had my family here, a lot of people from my family, and uh, that means the world to me. You know, uh, like I did in front of friends and family for my last game, especially in the last game in the Spectrum. And uh, you know, as a kid, like I said, I've always. Uh, had a dream of playing here and to end it like this and to have a career I've had, you know, it, feel, it feels great. Uh, and, you know, it's, it's awesome to go home and have like a, a brother and parents that are proud of the way I have been in my college career. And, uh, you know, I learned a lot from everybody here and that's great for me, great four years for me. And uh, it's just been a great experience in my life. And yeah, it's been a, it's been a good time. I mean, no, you know, we shot, we shot the ball really well. Uh, we guarded them, uh, you know, we went, we not, went up by 20 and, you know, uh, we were just playing well, you know, senior night. I, I mean, we won by 30, you know, you can't can't write it up any better than that. Like I said, me, Shane and Connor played well. And then everybody else that played well, you know, Kobe and Sam passed the ball well, you know, uh, Kobe was rebounding, you know, everybody just did what they needed to do for us to get a win like that. And that's what made it fun. Uh, honestly, the first play of the game when we were on defense, we got got a shot clock violation. I don't even know that that was like this is this is gonna be a fun night. You know we're playing we're playing hard on defense right now. That was we don't get many shot clock violations. That's a tough thing to do at this level. And so I, I was like we're clicking tonight. We're playing good defense. And uh, when we play good defense, our offense comes with us. They're just not forcing things. You know they're young. They're freshmen. Uh, they have a lot of pressure on them to be successful at, as freshmen. You know and uh, for the most part they do well with that. But you know you're a freshman. You get tired. The season's a lot longer than high school. You play against bigger guys. You know. Uh, so they, they get the uh, had to get used to that. Uh, I just talked them through it. You know, it's like, hey, so it's, it's a grind. You know, it, it takes a little bit for freshmen to get used to that. And uh, I think they're they're kind of recovering from all that stuff and just playing the game that they can do. And uh, you know, they're just not forcing things, letting the game come to them. And when they do that, they're they're really great players. Uh, you know, I think we we came out really aggressive tonight. Uh, you know, we dropped one at their house. So, you know, that was on everybody's minds. Uh, plus senior night, uh, you know, the guys wanted to, you know, send us off the right way. So uh, we just came out and, you know, did what we had to do. Uh, definitely, you know, uh, not only is it senior night, you know, we still got something to play for. You know, these last couple of games uh, could determine, you know, where we place at in the tournament. So uh, everybody was ready to go tonight and, you know, uh, with the senior night along with, you know, just in the back of our heads too that uh, these games mean something. Oh uh, yeah, man, you know, the spec is always uh, popping. So, you know, just, uh, it was great to see, you know, one last time before uh, me, Jay and CG left. So uh, I really appreciate all the fans and, you know, just thank them for all the support throughout the years. Man, it was that spectrum magic, baby. Um, just, you know, everybody was going tonight and once we put our foot on the pedal, you know, we ain't take it off. So. Uh, just, you know, like I said, a little bit of the spectrum magic and everybody was locked in. So it was just a, a great night. Uh, you know, just, just finishing the season strong. Uh, I think we're on the 2-0 and winning streak right now. So, you know, just getting some momentum, just going into the tournament. And plus, you know, that's where the tournament is at. So uh, it would be good to just, you know, get a game in on that floor and everything, just kind of like a warm-up for the tournament. So, you know. We just want to keep the momentum going, and you know we, we've been playing well for the past couple of games, so uh, we just want to keep that going. As far as senior nights go, that was um, unexpected on one hand, and and yet. Couldn't probably draw it up much better than that. Uh, thrilled for uh, for Jalen. I uh, thought he played tremendously well, uh, you know, which we're kind of getting used to. And then uh, Shane had a great night as well and uh, could not be happier for Connor Garner. Just uh, uh, so happy for him. I mean, that's, 
that's uh, good things happen to good people, and they don't come much better than Connor. So uh, our whole locker room was just elated for him. Um, I thought our tone was set early on. I thought our first defensive possession, we get a shot clock violation. Uh, they're throwing everything at us. You know, back cuts, ball screens, flare screens, uh, and we handled it all. Got a shot clock violation. I thought that set the tone defensively. And then offensively, uh, Shane, Sam, Kobe, 20 assists, three turnovers. Um, I thought we played really well offensively. We settled in, just made a lot of really simple plays. And, um, you know, when you do that, you shoot a high percentage and, and you score a lot of points, and that's what happened. Yeah, you know, I mean, it, it, we didn't run anything special for him to get over 10 points. We were just kind of playing our, our motion offense, and if something good happened for him, that would be good. Usually in those situations, when you when you try to put a guy in a position like that and spotlight him, it usually doesn't turn out real well. So uh, I thought Connor was just playing along fine, and, and uh, you know, that, that's how he plays on the scout team. He, he shoots it in, and he's a good player. Uh, and and he's you know did a great job and he did a great job on the other end too which that's what you kind of worry about with a guy like that has no game action a system like that that's really hard to guard um he did a tremendous job yeah it's um that that's hard to figure out but um you know there's a couple of like that i told our team uh, you know, don't look back, look ahead, leave the looking back to me. And the, that's the frustrating part. Look ahead. Uh, you know, they're playing well. Uh, again, I thought we kind of took off, took up where we left off from San Jose uh, with our comfort level. I thought we were very comfortable at San Jose, really settled into the game, seeing everything very clearly, um, very connected as a group. And I thought we started the game the exact same way. And you know, we didn't know if they'd start man or zone. They've, they've played both on the road, uh, but, you know, and, and we did a good enough job against the zone to make them go man and, and just move the ball and, and played really well.